Hey guys, Ill Spawn here with RealGamersOnline.com. Uh, going to do this. Should be the last one of the All Legends team here for this set. Yeah. And then I got one more series to finish. And I should be done for the week. Here we go. Hello everybody, it's the coach welcoming you to Madden Ultimate Team. This is the NFL yep. on EA Sports. Up next, we've got a good one on tap between the visiting Houston Texans and the Madden Legends. The Madden Legends. That'll be taken in the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback and it comes out to the 25-yard line. And now the offense getting set, first and ten. Set. Green 39! Green 39! Cut. Throwing on first down. Graham. Over the middle, that's caught by Rice. Yeah, good catch, four. Rice. It's second down. Okay, so let's see here. In the first quarter, he's going to get some catches, but they rallied to him quickly. And that's what you count on, and I like what you just said. First quarter, can you do it all game long? They catch it, you tackle them, they go down on the spot. Because when you're able to do that, you don't give up big chunks of yardage after the catch. Dang it. Now you put the offense in a position. Mess that up, mess that up, guys. They have to work hard to Chris Johnson. Downs, and you tend to stall them out when you do that. Well, one unit I know you want to watch is that offensive line. If they keep clearing holes like that, it could be a long night defensively. Go no doubt about it, because when they are in sync, as we're seeing so far, nice. Good job, Poe. You can see that they're playing off. That Poe, man, he's a, he's a he's a killer up there, man. You're exactly right. It could be a very long night for the defense because someone's going to run for some big yardage. Early down stuff to put this offense in a precarious position. We know the securing the point of attack, especially against the big body guys in the middle of this day, has got to be priority one. Completing it to the right side. Oh, nice job. And he'll get it out to midfield. Looks like, yeah, they'll spot it right at midfield at the 50. Eight yards and the completion, but now they face third down. Johnson, and he has the first oh man, Chris Johnson. Come on, guys. They get five out of that one, and it moves to James. Defense had a chance to get off the field here in the opening drive, couldn't do it. I know that we go into these meetings with coaches, and sometimes maybe we can get, you know, a little bit numb because they're always going to talk about how important third down is. Nice. Who was that, in Simon? Case, one capitalized, and the other, as you said, had a chance to get off the field, but yeah. didn't get it done. An interesting and intriguing decision there defensively because they kept extra DBs on the field despite seeing the multiple tight end look that came out for the offense. I thought they were going to switch out of it. I didn't know if they felt they didn't have time or what the case was. You know, in any event, the extra speed allowed nice. for penetration as they stuffed that one behind the line of scrimmage. That catch good for five. It's third down. One thing we do know, he's going to get his catches. So as they move forward defensively, Got to continue to focus on not giving up the big play when he does catch the ball in the second day. On third down, Graham. And that is nice. Good job, guys. Okay, okay. Had an open man Field goal. Time, but ended up putting a little too much heat on it, don't you think, partner? Absolutely. Just needed a touch more air under it. Instead, he fired an absolute bullet. The hell? It's no good. Okay. Over first and ten up near midfield. Two Goes. sides every coin. This is the bad side of missing the 58 yarder. Now they All right, started Johnson. the 48. Johnson or Thielson. On first down, it's McNair. Oh, it's a time he shot right away. Money. Yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Calvin Johnson, 52 yards. 
Texans are able to show off their quick strike ability. And man, Charles, talking about zinging something in there. Those gloves, they help with one-handed catchers, the fun stuff. Any padding for a rocket like that? One would think so, but I'll guarantee you this, after that throw, his hands will hurt later. Not right now in the moment. He's just feeling good about catching it. Yeah, a little steer, yeah. but a touchdown. That's fielded in the uh, And he won't return this one. He'll go down to a knee, and they'll yeah. start at the 25. That doesn't look anything like Bettis. The size kind of does, but Last time out, the face they had that long 50-plus yard field goal that they missed. And I'm sure on their sideline, they're thinking to themselves, okay, do we still want to try one if we're in that position again? And I would dare say that the answer would be yes. They're going to have a lot of confidence in their kicker. But just to be on the safe side, I'm sure they told their offensive guys, can we get a little bit closer? Nice. Texans able to get in there for the sack. Ely. Cody Ely able to get him for a loss of about three. And we say it all the time, have to be able to get rid of the ball sooner than that. You have to help your offensive line out. They're going to protect you as best mm -hmm. they can. And if you're getting three to five seconds to throw the ball, they're doing a really nice job. But when you Damn. Go and give up a sack, that dude, man. Almost discrediting their work. That one goes for 13 yards and it moves. Jeez. And it all came together there in breaking route. Drove it with excellent pace. Money throw right there. All right, guys. The sticks. First down carry here for Johnson. Fighting oh, come on, guys. Oh, my God. Look how fast he is compared to my guys. And those aren't slow people. 65 yards. And the Madden Legends with the extra point can tie this football game. And on that long run, maybe the defense caught napping a little bit. The concentration level may not have been there. I agree with you on that one because those types of plays, when they result like that, they're almost like big bolts of lightning, aren't they? Whoosh, and off he goes. Fielded about a yard deep. And spins away. And now running right through it. And the decision to bring it out is a good one as he's up a yard or two shy of the 30. And now out comes Houston. And last time the formula was pretty simple. One play drive, long pass. That Maybe they just want to do that again, right? And that's exactly how you want to draw things up. Whether it's on your grease board, right, in your playbook. One play drive is exactly what you want on offense. But they have to be careful of is not having a letdown. In oh, my goodness. They can't expect that going forward. Yeah, we'll see if it's that easy here. Meanwhile, they take a shot to start the drive, but this is going to wind okay. up Okay, I'm wanting the right like something that they safety to come up here ready for this one. i don't know if the he is or isn't right out of the gate at worst you'd open up the defense a little bit loosen them up have them back on their heels second down mcnair oh, a bad nice here, and this will be caught he had the touchdown on the opening drive now he's got a first down two minutes to play in a tightly contested Very nice. first half my good friend Charles and I right back <clears throat> at you after this. Four verticals. Fans, a reminder. I have a note card here that says ad lib halftime previews. So I guess let's do just that as we'll hand things over to Jonathan Coachman in Orlando when this one reaches halftime. Did I do okay? You did great. Oh, 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 oh. Writing down your ad -libs. If you print it, I'm going to read it. I'm Brandon Goddard. Looking for more there on first down, but this throw downfield incomplete. Sure, that pass was incomplete as they made an attempt to get a big one downfield, but that's okay because the second part of that is if you don't get the completion, at least you've told the defense you're trying to stretch them out a little bit, and they may have to change accordingly. Flushed out right. Now he'll money, money. Oh yeah. And he's gonna have this oh down yeah. Houston, 45 yards. In our pregame meeting, all they talked about was keeping him hemmed in and wanting him to make his throws from the pocket because they knew he was pretty dangerous if he got outside. Cut. And he just showed it right there. Pretty good arm, too. Ah. And this is going to be caught, but they'll say out of bounds. Okay. So it's incomplete. Good job, McNair. For his tight end, Hunter Henry. And now it's second down. Love his pocket awareness, able to slip out of the sack. But once you take your eyes off the receivers, once your eyes come down and you see the rush, 
Hard to get back downfield to find yeah. yeah. Who, who is that? Who is that? Christian McCaffrey. <coughs> Very good. Good job, guys. And it was a tight window. He knew he had to rocket that thing in there. He got it done. And when you're able to complete like that, your confidence has to just go sky high. You just mentioned it. Tight window. Zings it in there despite excellent coverage. Result, touchdown. Santos out now. Santos, you can do it, buddy. This nope. will be taken to the back of the end zone. And no mm. run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. Out now come the legends. And for them, a touchdown their last go around. Obviously, All right, Poe, let's that. do this. And when you start plotting for this drive, when you start thinking to yourself, okay, what are we going to do? You don't go away from what you did before because that worked. But you have to be prepared for wrinkles and counters because you know they'll make some adjustments. Uh, Damn, guys. Quit screwing up. Across midfield. A big chunk on the ground there. 27 yards. First down, Graham, and quickly to his tight end, Clark, that's caught. Now the offense going to use the first of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 55 seconds to go until halftime. All right, here we go. 319! 319! Looking to throw on second down. Graham, over the middle. Bam! It's Rice. And now before the <coughs> first down play, we're going to get a timeout. Come on, guys. As the clock shows 50 seconds to play here in half Come on. You got to stop this. The 37 on first and 10. All right, here we go. On first and 10, Graham. He'll get it in the hands of Clark. Complete. And he'll work it inside the 30 to the 29-yard line. A good pick up there. Eight yards on the first down completion. Seeing that play and understanding just how tough it is to cover tight ends, especially the ones running around the NFL right, nowadays, Green, makes me glad I didn't make it in that league. I would have had a really difficult time. But now you get to sit up here with me. Yeah, that's <coughs> yeah. a really nice game right there on first down for them. Brings up a nice second down for them. It'll be a pickup of four, good enough to earn them yet another first down. One thing you're hoping for when you run drag routes. You're able to hit a receiver in stride, and you can pick up a lot of yardage after the catch. But in this situation, the defense was affected. Oh, so man. Right there, too. Okay, guys. Come on, Peters. From the left hash, this will be a 41-yarder. Oh, they get to the football. It's blocked. And now they'll take a timeout defensively. After the second down play, they burn the timeout. Oh, uh, what? They can sweat out the final few ticks here in the second quarter. Anderson's kick is good. We have hit. And okay, so much for our halftime break. Apparently we're going to get right back to it. Anderson now to kick this one away. This fielded a few yards into the end zone. Oh my He's God, that was horrible. To the 22 yard line. Okay. Theo post shot. Now. They get set it's all you feeling. The they have the lead now. They'll be looking for some separation here as we begin the third quarter. I like the way you turn that because now I think they go a little bit deeper into their playbook. They like what they did in the first half. That worked okay. But in order to get the separation that you just... Nice! Look at that. Triple coverage. That's a big time pitch and catch right there. And partner, I remember the days when quarterbacks would try this. They were holding their breath. But nowadays, they're counting on their receiver to be just a little bit yeah. the defensive back. When it's one on one and the ball's in the air like that. That one one on one. On first down, it'll set up a second and seven. Tough there we go. For him, unable to put up the numbers he's used to producing, but with a guy like him, you and I both know it just takes a couple of explosive touches yeah. for him to make an impact on this game and on the stash as well. Here's McCaffrey, and he'll take this in <coughs> 20 and down to the 18. 
Give him three on the run there. Now they're looking at a four verticals. In the first half, he was held in check on the ground, but despite that lack of production, they still have the lead. Yeah, and they've got to feel fortunate about that. If they could actually get production from their lead horse, that would help open up this offense. Oh, I think that was a touchdown. They take a shot at the end zone, but it's incomplete. Not only was the call spot on, how about the execution of that defense right there? Zone Bam. Was absolutely locked up tight. He was trying to force it in there on third down. But if there's a time to force it, he felt like he needed to make a play, right? Yeah, exactly right. Third down, you got to try and find something. There's nothing available there for him. All right. So Just going to bring it out. Chris Johnson. Line, no. They do get three. Chris Johnson is a good player. Nowadays, and when yeah. they have these types of kicks that no one says to their guy, hey, that's just like making an extra point, piece of cake. Because the extra point is not a piece of cake anymore. <laughs> but kicking a field goal from that distance, just give him confidence and let him knock it through. All right, here we go. Now a play fake here on first down. And it's incomplete. Took <coughs> couldn't connect. Calvin Johnson, the intended receiver. And that'll bring up second yep. down. They have not gotten him going at all. Tried to spark something there with a longer throw. Unable to complete it. But you have to keep trying. He's one of their best playmakers. Yeah, there we go. Good job, guys. And not a whole lot doing there as he'll get it up to about the 28-yard line. Oftentimes we praise an offense for their variety of being able to hit people with the run in the pass. But in this game, how about what we're seeing from the safeties? Come on, guys. There you go. Unit, but you're right, it might go to them in this game. I like that. All right, all right, all right, all right. Now Sanders, he spins three. Ah, oh, man. Too far from breaking that officially. Yeah, I should have juked on that last one. And the Texans will take over for the first and ten. Okay, Christian McCaffrey, come on. The drive begins with a run by McCaffrey. And That's good. Stop him after a fairly minimal pickup. Give him a couple of carry <coughs> there, second and eight. Well, they're hoping that the second half is better for him than the first half. They've got to find a way to get him going. He's a big part of their offense. Welcome back live to Orlando. It's the Texans in control of the football and leading this game Let's as see well here. as we okay. start the okay. fourth. It's what we want. Our PA crossover. See that? See that? Johnson's going to be open. Towards the 50 marker. They go play action. It's McMahon. They'll roll him out right. On the crossing route. Complete. It's Johnson. And they've got it well across midfield. Yeah. Down to the 40 before it's all said and done. A gain of 32 that time. Red part, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end. But how about the way they flip field position there? A nice <coughs> Okay, Christian play. McCaffrey. Let's go. Of a chunk of yardage. On first down, this is McCaffrey. There he goes. This inside the 30. A pickup of 11 and a Texans first down. Well, it is our business to analyze what we saw out there in our <coughs> play. I saw a defense staying in base, not taking a chance, not blitzing. There we go. In a situation where they absolutely need the football back. That's either a case of overthinking it or not thinking it through. Oh, oh get up. But I think a Texan player was able to get his hands Who got it? it? And they will indeed hold on to the ball and the possession. That's no, okay. Fortune there. He wasn't able to get it back, but he did have a teammate on the spot able to retain. That's okay. We can do this. We got it. We got it. Halfback dive. Halfback dive. Let's flip it. They've got a second down now as they search for a way to get this one to the finish line. On second down, McCaffrey. Ah! Good run. Good run, baby. Good run. All right. What we got? Third and sixteen. Huh, what well, should we do? Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Uh, let's do bench. Now, this is a big third down. You <coughs> have to think we'd see a timeout right away if they can't stop him here. Here's McNabb. Oh. Oh, incomplete. Oh. The pick they needed. They would have loved one there, but at least it does get them to fourth down. 
I think he's taking an awful chance with the football right there. You've got a lead. You've got to protect it. And he's taking chances, putting it out there in a little bit of jeopardy. Man. Especially in a spot like this, fourth quarter, as you said, trying to cling to that advantage. Yeah, that one probably should have been picked, huh? And here's a big one now. Try to hold this lead. They're going to go for it here on fourth down. A play fake. Now McNabb. Oh. Shit. Oh, man. <laughs> the Boo Birds are out. For the team that lost it to get it back. Pick up a 33 yards. So the big play means just like that, they'll operate from the red zone now on first down. Right, here we go. Green 39. Green 39. Right. Back to throw. That is caught at the seven. <laughs> the yeah. Six, seven. Good job, Mills. They were hoping to get down there, get the score, and get this thing into overtime. How deflating. Absolutely. I mean, Let's face it, heartbreaking. They had an opportunity, had a chance, and probably were feeling pretty good about what was going on, and that was taken away from them by their own mistake. The opportunity squad. There you go, Williams. Good and job. Get this only up to about the three-yard line. <coughs> now a stoppage here. We'll get another timeout as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. Have to imagine this will be on the ground as well as they come up second and seven. Yeah. <laughs> Let's move over, fools. You ain't got nothing on me. Bam. Bam. Mm. Boom, chakalaka. Ah. Despite my bad play calling, we still win. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Nah, I didn't do too well there, did I, guys? Let's see what we got here. No, nah, a level. Ooh, what can it be? I wonder. A collectible. <gasps> a nice fullback. Oh. I might be able to use him. Oh, yeah. Good lord. It's a beast. Yeah. Yeah. He's a, he's definitely going to be the star. Maybe not. I may. What? Is he a trade? Can I trade him? Oh, I could just, uh, training. That's a lot of training points. And I'll make training later. And I don't use full packs that often. <clears throat> All right. So, anyway, that's it for now.
It's Zill Spawn from Real Gamers Online. Until next time, have a good day or night.